And living in a city like Jerusalem right now, I mean, growing up in West Jerusalem was a great town to grow up in. And realizing that a 20 minute, you know, literally crossed the line into what Joe Fal uh, Halper was describing as a third world country, um, a, a, is a hypocrisy, um, for lack of a better word. Uh, knowing that I can't, I can't live these standards, um, uh, knowing that uh, we, the, the double standard where the, the other citizens of but my town But why not? Plenty in. of people here and there say, I don't care what happens on the other side of that wall. I don't care what happens outside my community. Not according to my Jewish upbringing. That doesn't fit. That doesn't fit the moral standards that I was brought up on. And, and I don't f think it fits the, the, the basic Israeli culture that I was brought up on. I think we can do so much better over there. The potential in Jerusalem is um, is outrageous. Uh, usually we, we think, uh, we're brought up to think uh, worst case scenario constantly. Uh, I grew up in the 90s. Buses were, were blowing up constantly in, in Jerusalem. We were going to funerals uh, in the cemeteries all the time. Um, and, and, and the fear that people have gotten used to um, has, has brought us to, to just to com always think uh, worst mm. case scenario. But to never take the next step uh, and to realize all these different things that are happening around us, all these different um, organizations and, and projects that are happening in, in and around East Jerusalem. There's some amazing examples. Mm -hmm.